Hi, Joe here with the Ice Resin Mixed Media Design Team. Today I'm going to show you how to turn a pod which came from a palm tree um, after it dries it's kind of wood-like. We're going to turn that into a decorative bowl. So the first thing that you're going to do, I started with a regular cork, cut it into little slices which I already went ahead and attached to the bottom as feet to keep it from rocking. So that makes it nice and stable. So the first thing I'm going to do, I pre-mix the resin here. I'm going to pour a little bit in there. I'm going to start off with a fairly thin layer. Since the bowl is curved, if I put it on too heavy, it's all going to pull at the bottom, which I don't want. I'm just using just one of the little cheap little bristle brushes you get in the paint department at the hardware store. The nice thing about applying this onto a wood-like surface, if you can see, it's starting to get very dark, like a rich wood. If you can see that there, which is really nice. I'm going to spread this all the way. Then I'm going to let it cure overnight before applying my second layer. Hi, I'm back. I allowed it to cure overnight. You can see now the beautiful rich color as opposed to the light part underneath. Uh, one thing I did forget to mention, these brushes are notorious for losing bristles. So it's a good idea to go through and pull any loose bristles out so they don't end up stuck in your project. So I've gone ahead and given it a second coat. Now, if you like the natural look here, you can stop. Uh, but I'm going to take it a step further. I'm going to incorporate some of the tattered mica from the iced enamels line into this just for a little shimmer. I'm going to spread it out. You can do it as light or heavy as you choose. I'm going to go a little on the light side just to give a little shimmer but to still keep more of the natural look of this. This is looking like just about enough. So again, we're going to allow that to cure and give it one final coat on top to seal all of the mica in. Um, and then it will be ready to use. So we'll be back after it cures. Hmm. Here is a look at the finished pod. I don't know if you're able to see the tattered mica in there. I think you can get a look at it. There's a better shot. So it came out pretty nice. You can put things in the bowl or just display it as is. It's beautiful. If you're fortunate enough to live in an area where you have palm trees and can find these pods, they really are wonderful. Um, be sure to keep ice resin in mind for your home decor projects and I will see you soon.